Okay, okay good morning. Uh, so yeah, today is the carpet day. We're just getting ready to go. Still not quite light enough in here, but this is all the kind of car booty stuff. Car booty. <laughs> the sexy car boot. Okay, so we're going. I'm really tired and stressed and annoyed. How are you feeling? Uh, I look rough as ass. Okay, how are you doing? This is all the stuff we're selling in the back. Perhaps a nice 15 minute drive will cheer me up. 10 minutes. Terminus. Brilliant. Nice little brain tumor for us as we set up underneath these foul piles. It's quite a small one, isn't it? Stuff? I don't know. Behind us, I guess. Like everyone else. Just Should we get out and have a look? Any computer games? Um, not at the minute. No, it's like. Any open for that no, no. Do you want to look out and we'll go for a wander? I mean, it's not open yet for a little while, so we can have a. Do you to win? Eight or something, so we've got some. Are you time. sure? Yeah. Because that's what they said on the internet, just to kind of look up and go for a wander if you don't want people dressing you while you're sitting up. It's so annoying because people are just like looking into our car window. I didn't get much of that. There was a bloke that literally just walked up to our car and just kind of looked into the window. Really? Yeah, just to Look see. To our car. This is why I, I heat things up, like the guitar and anything of any value, like the fucking radio thing, because I knew it. People start smashing our window. I'm not even awake. It's crazy. Huh? I'm not even awake. I don't know, everyone else is on form. I'm so sleepy, so I don't know. I need to pull my trousers up, but my hands are full. One's got phone and the other's got our coffee. No, it might look weird. We really haven't got that much stuff so we should be, it's like an hour? An hour to sell this probably? To sell it? Yeah, an hour. Gotta be honest, I'm a, I feel like a bit of an idiot putting some price stickers. <laughs> Oh, no one else has done that. I think we're like the obvious Some noobs have prizes to this. Like, you know, you've done it before. Once. <laughs> like three I years. I, four I years ago. I, I did it when I was a kid. Oh, did you? Oh, you didn't tell me that. You've got loads of experience. Yeah, when you were a kid, it. how old were you? I don't know, but me and mummy, I did at least did a few. Oh, that's right. I didn't realise I was in the hands of a professional car boot out here. Lucy's left me in charge of the table. I'm very good at visual merchandising. This is this is what we have so far. This, I think, is going to sell very quickly, as will the, the lampshade. We'll make our money on these two items and then we can go. <laughs> I really think I should try playing some Beatles just to kind of get an audience and then no, okay. <laughs> One theory is if I start playing the guitar, if it's bad, someone might buy it to stop me. If I start skipping, that'll draw some attention to the skipping route. <laughs> I can't skip anyway, so that's quite useful. Yes, get the lampshade out there. The lampshade, that generated a lot of attention, that lampshade. So push the lampshade, Lucy, just like front it up, right here. People would like love the lampshade. <laughs> Lucy has come to the conclusion that it's good to kind of change the layout of the table. Yeah, you keep changing it like every half hour. Good think it's a different stool. <laughs> this is really exciting. I can kind of feel my brain frying slightly from the electrical cables above my head. This is like drugs because you know how like when you deal drugs you shouldn't take drugs? It's kind of like that, a car boot. You're trying to sell stuff at car boot, you shouldn't go around buying stuff at a car boot because you're just going to accumulate as much junk as you're trying to get rid of. Crazy. No. Okay, so it's nine o'clock. We've sold some stuff, it's okay. We're just going to keep going to about two and then we're going to have some um, roast dinner. I'm really surprised that all the Lucy merchandise hasn't gone. <laughs> just an entire stall of Lucy products. Um, <laughs> we just want that one buyer, that one buyer that's going to buy everything that says Lucy on it. <laughs> so we great. <laughs> so sold that lampshade. Can you just pop that lampshade on the table? So, uh, yeah. Reference. Uh, 
So we need to sell that lampshade. That's, that's my mission. Well, there are a few books left. Give it away. Just happen. give it away to someone. Be like, free lampshade with that purchase there. Congratulations. That's Thank lovely. You. Can you change the tempo and note, all right? I can, yeah. Would you like a pink lampshade? <laughs> <laughs> no, pink isn't really my colour, but thank you. There we are. <laughs> I will sell that at some point. It's my never mission. Know. <laughs> you Probably never know. Just try and give it away, then, yeah. now. Oh, That's it. <laughs> Fine. If you know anyone that is after a pink lampshade, then yeah. you know, do please send them all. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks so much. Lovely, take care. Just to show a bit more flesh, I think that will really help. Give <laughs> <laughs> the pink lampshade as well for free if you like. <laughs> no. Thank you. Okay. Oh yeah, that's true. It's Father's Day today. Yeah. So Happy Father's Day to everyone. Yeah. It's, it's really annoying, isn't it? It's Father's Day, and the only person who doesn't get a card is Father Christmas. You all forget about Father Christmas on Father's Day. You don't send him a card. Everyone is his children. They write to him at Christmas, but when it comes to Father's Day, well, you know, it's not good. It's actually it's called Santa Claus. It's Father Christmas. Every Christmas, all the kids write him a, a letter saying, I want this, I want that. But come Father's Day, he gets nothing back. So I, I, it's just not fair. Poor Father Christmas, sat in the North Pole right now, crying his eyes out. Should we take the price off this? Let's send him that pink lampshade. It's now 10 face 6. It's pretty much dying here. Yeah. Well, not. everyone it's, behind us has left. It's still a hard bar. Um, and it's looking pretty glum. It's out absolutely. And I felt I don't know what we're going to do. My <laughs> hair is terrible. It's putting everyone off. No. Um, <laughs> it's about to rain. So we pack this up, donate the rest to charity, and then go and have a roast dinner. It's too early for a roast dinner. Okay. Well, that is true. This is such a depressing shot. Lampshades, buy a lampshade. 50p lampshade. It's a bargain. It's a bargain. Here we go, we're gonna just see what the what we've done, if it was worth it. King loaded, oh, I'm loaded. Oh. Please, stop making it rain. Loaded, rain, <laughs> money. Come on. Okay, let's okay. go, let's go. So mission was successful, we made enough money for our the trip. Money. We should always we doubled that. the money we came with. And we are good to go to Devon, we're not short now. We are in the ribs of beef, having some lunch. Found. I was worried that it was going to take us ages to find somewhere to have a roast dinner, Lucy. Yeah. Good old dish ship. <laughs> nice. What do you think to our excellent... So if we haven't put it in the video already, we'll put it in the video now. Basically, obviously the last video that we did was quite sad um, because we hadn't got a date for our, our wedding. So there have been developments and what we've done is, well, so the lady uh, emailed us a whole bunch of dates, brilliant, and we chose one of them. So I emailed her back and I said, this date ideally, but we obviously, no, we can't, you know, it's not official until we paid our deposit. And she says she can hold it for us for three weeks. So it's like 98% chance of us now having that, that we have a particular date. date and it's basically autumn 2019. Yeah, we don't, we can't tell you the date, but, but we're happy with it. So. so it's going to be September next year and actually we thought about it yeah. and September would have been when we met because we met at uni. Yeah, anyway, there we go. To the wedding date. Indeed. Wait. Oh, by me, that was lovely. Yeah, lovely, thank, thank you. you. Oh, look, we're those um, types of people that film their food, but you are. yeah. That's not <laughs> that was amazing. So nice. We'll definitely be going back to the ribs of beef for a Sunday roast. Okay. Do you want to have a look in this charity shop? But look at this painting. I walked past this the other day on the way to work and I just thought this has got to be the most depressing and, I don't know, haunted picture you'll ever see. It's well, a picture trees. of trees on fire and it looks like the church is on fire. fire. Does it not look like that church is on fire? That's a big crucifix. <laughs> it's well spooky. You see. You see trees on fire. It just looks burnt and... Do you not see that? It could just be autumn. And and like the sun is setting, mm -hmm. but you went crazy trees. When you went arson. I have a vision. Let's have a look in the charity shop. What's this? Flash pad. Hello. 
Ten, ten, ten. Okay, you get fast. I win. That's that's cool. How much is that? Free. <laughs> yes, I'll take it. Jingling a ling to you, Lucy. And to you. And to you. And to you. That young lad in that shop, he came, came in and the, the guy in the shop was like, you have to get out with that. And so then, you know, in a kind of rebellious act, he stood in the doorway and was like, ding a ling a ling to you. <laughs> <laughs> Just, I was like, what? Yeah, he did do that. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs>